One hour later. Ladies and gentlemen, the prodigal son has returned, and its name is the Anvil Terrapin. Yes, that's right, gentlemen. The the, the premier dogfighter in Star Citizen's world is the very angry, very space version of Ninja Turtles, and it's amazing. I mean, I did not expect anything from this from this ship. I thought I would get in this thing and promptly be swifted my way back to Grimhex's medical facility for even attempting to do something like this. But you will see <laughs> after this fight that the impossible can happen if you follow the rules of flight combat and you just trade, trade all day. You know, all joking aside, the Terrapin, um, is made of essentially dragon skin hopes and dreams and pledge packages i mean this ship this ship is straight thick i mean every inch of this ship is armored even the door is double armored i mean it's ridiculous i mean all you have is two size two guns i mean granted you have 125 rounds in the gun um <laughs> this thing can trade all day and with the turn rate that's not totally terrible you know, it's, uh, you can manage it, right? Um, but, you know, I, I really don't think I should be winning fights in the Terrapin, and I do think it's just because, uh, so many of us are learning, you know, learning how to, how to play the game. Uh, this, this video, as you can tell, is, is not gonna be a very serious video. Um, you know, flying the Ninja Turtle in space, uh, is it has been an absolute blast and the salt that we received after flying this thing was quite funny uh, But I don't hold it against anybody. I would be a little upset too if I got killed by the angry Ninja Turtle of doom, but uh, <laughs> Again, right? It, it's all the same stuff. I've been preaching guys on the stream and on the channel I mean every day you hear me say it you know, roll, 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 roll into your targets, right? I did a little bit of experimenting with the VTOL mode you'll see in a second here. Uh, you know, getting getting close and getting within that turn fight, I thought, you know, what would happen if I start switching my VTOL engines around? And, you know, was that going to give me an extra little bit of oomph when it comes to getting in these fights here, you know? But uh, we, can, we can discuss today uh, trading. Uh, you know, the ultimate trade mobile would be the Terrapin because, I mean, she's got a, a ludicrous amount of hit points. She's got thick shields, you know, so I don't need to worry about really any kind of counter maneuvering. All I need to worry about is uh, like, oh, look, someone's shooting at me. That's cute, you know, and just <laughs> just just work on getting my angle and slowly, slowly and steadily, I will win the race, uh, you know, just like just like a turtle, right? Uh, it's just got a, a dummy thick hull and a dummy thick shield and I don't really care about doing any kind of J-hooks or corkscrews or anything. All I gotta do is slowly get my nose back onto target and keep the pressure up. Because that arrow that's taking damage right now, I mean, that one little size one shield, like, <laughs> really, it's not doing the arrow any favors, that's for sure. Uh, again, so my shields are down now, which isn't the end of the world. I've got some ludicrous amount of hit points to uh, to tank through all of that. But the arrow here, uh, not doing too good. You know, slowly but surely, just chipping away at it like, a, you know, like a woodcutter. Slowly cutting down a big tree, just slowly chipping away. Again, rolling into my turn, strafing up nice and hard. You know, getting getting best I can. Now, th this is where I, re where I reversed the circle because I was losing that raid fight. So I thought, you know what, let's just switch the angle here. Let's go and flip the circle upside down here and see if he catches on, which he didn't in time. Back into it. Okay, let's flip it the other way again. Let's see what he does. Create some distance. I like where I'm at. And I'm, I'm getting my dummy thick shields back up this whole time too. He's so terrified of getting out of my cone of fire that he's giving up great opportunities to put pressure on me and I'm getting my shields back. And there it is. Slowly and steadily, the turtle wins the race. So you think, okay, maybe once it's a fluke, okay... No, 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 no. We're, we're not done yet. After the first loss, the aeropilot decided, no, 
this is unacceptable. And rightfully so. If I was the Arrow pilot, I would be a little frustrated too. I'd be like, what are you talking about? A Terrapin. So we thought, let's go again. And I thought for sure, I'm like, nah, there's no way. You know, he's probably got ballistic cannons or something set up to kill the Terrapin. So, you know, but we're having a lot of fun. We're joking around. We thought, what could, what could possibly, what could possibly go wrong? Surely the Terrapin <laughs> couldn't take another match off the Arrow. You know, this is, of course, after I got done dummying a uh, Super Hornet with a shotgun build. Bruh. But, uh, you know, it, it happens. Um, I really should not be winning these fights, guys. I mean, it, it, to kill a Terrapin, you just got to get up on it and uh, and punish it, right? Or you want you can stay at range and just have him constantly be trying to get close to you. So again, right, same standard procedure, right? Rolling into my turn. He's got Ballistic Cannon, so he's got a tremendous amount of firepower. You know, and, uh, <laughs> you know, again, slowly but surely, we start uh, chipping away at him. And, uh, oh, I just realized I forgot that was the Buccaneer, not even a, not even an arrow. This is even worse. You know, it's got twice, if not three times the firepower that the arrow had. And this Terrapin is just taking it like a champ. This is like Muhammad Ali and Rumble in the Jungle. Boom, and there it is, right? <laughs> <laughs> You know, um, that's just the way she rolls, guys. Um, again, right? The Terrapin is a trading mobile. I mean, all it wants you to do is stare at its face and have its two little tiny size guns just slowly pick it away. They'll pick you away. So, um, <laughs> not too much to go over today, guys, in terms of maneuvering or any kind of, like, breakdowns. This was a fun video I just wanted to show you guys to let you know that you know, uh, operator control, distance control, understanding your fundamentals. Man, if you can master that stuff, guys, you can you can have a lot of fun. I was Avenger1. I hope to see you all up for stream. The Ninja Turtle is back, baby! And I will see you all in the next video.